Okay. Hello. 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 Hi, everybody. And, uh, welcome along to Building Instruments Part 2. Uh, so uh, today we are following on from um, Building Instruments Part Part 1, unsurprisingly, which we did um, before Christmas. Um, and you can find a edited version of that on our um, the seminars wiki um, page. Um, but so today we're, we're basically just um, following on from that. We're looking how uh, to build MIDI rigs and stuff. Um, just so you know, there is um, some documentation that Dave has put together. Currently, we've put all the bel canto together before the seminar this week. Um, so uh, you can find that on this week's wiki page, which I've just posted into the chat room there. Um, so as per usual, uh, if you've got any questions uh, or anything like that, do put them to the Justin TV chat. But if they're slightly off topic, save them towards the end, just so we don't get too distracted. Um, hopefully you can all hear us and stuff as normal. If you can't, let us know. Um, but yeah, so um, off to you, Dave. That okay, a, cheers. A quick, <laughs> quick one today. <laughs> cool. Okay, hi. Um, so first of all, I'm going to do it slightly different today. So I'm going to start with... Um, just finishing off something we didn't quite manage to get sorted last time. So I'm going to um, quickly look at connecting up uh, switch pedals to talkers. Um, so I'll do that quickly first. Uh, the first, so, so let's just do that. So the first thing to do is open the Eigen Commander. Uh, so Eigen D, Tools, Eigen Commander. And then you get this. I'm sure you're all familiar with this now. Um, okay, so First thing we want to do. Okay, so I've plugged in. I've plugged in this pedal into um, switch uh, switch pedal input one on on the Base Station Pro. Uh, so that inside Eigen D, that's represented as uh, pedal three. So we've got four pedal inputs on the Base Station. There's uh, the two expression pedals or volume pedals, and then there's the two switch pedals. So pedal one is expression pedal one. Pedal two is expression pedal two, and then pedal three is switch pedal one, and pedal four is switch pedal. Um, Four. Okay, so so what I'm going to do is just do a quick example of how to connect up the switch pedal to um, to make it change the octave of key group. So I'm going to do this on the alpha. Um, I'm going to do it for key group one. Okay, so key group one is the big key group that covers the whole split. So the first thing we need to do. Um, okay, so the last time we tried it, uh, what went wrong is I, I tried to create a brand new talker. Um, just specifically for doing this. It turns out, I think, that we need to use a talker that's already in the system and connected up to a key group somehow. So, so first of all, for the octave, if every key group in the alpha setup has, um, has a talker. Sorry, Dave, um, can you just um, hold the pedal up so people can see what kind of pedal it is? And sure. It's just a relatively cheap pedal from... It is, yeah, it's just a 10 quid switch pedal. Um, I don't know who it's made by, but it's got a reverse, you can reverse the polarity on the back. So, but yeah, it's just a, just a kind of like momentary. It's not it doesn't latch or anything, but just press it once don't, to kind don't of break it again. Don't break it again. Yeah. Um, so so this is plugged into switch pedal input one. What I'm going to do is connect that to control the octave of key group one. Now every key group, um, every key group in the alpha setup, the factory setups, has a talker associated with it, which controls the octaves, and you can see the talkers. They are basically these two orange lights down the bottom that, um, that put the octave up and down. So there's the octave up one here and the octave down one here. Um, so each key group has its own talker that does that for it. Key group one, it's called octave talker one. Um, key group two, octave talker two. Key group three, octave talker three. Um, so the first thing we need to do is um, in octave talker one, at the moment, uh, there's already one key. So this says something like um, when, when you hit that, put the octave down when you hit that one, the octave up. So we've already got those two keys. I need to create a new kind of invisible key inside that talker to connect the pedal to. So that'll, that'll make sense in a second. So first of all, I say octave talker listen. Okay, so there you go, octave talker listen. Check down here, it says okay. Um, and then key group, K group one listen. So this is just, this is the same process if, as if I was creating a talker to be, um, to be triggered off the keyboard. Okay, octave talker listen, K group one listen. So now in my conversation, I've got the talker and the thing that I want to control, which is key group one. Um, the next thing I need to write is I need to create this kind of uh, virtual key um, to turn the octave down. So I'm going to say when, um, so normally to turn the octave down, I'd say K group one hey or K group one listen, and I'd just say octave down or I'd say octave up. 
Um, there's a, we did a seminar on talkers, but to make it into a talker, I just need to stick this little when x phrase in it. So I'd say something like octave when one down. If I said octave when one down now, what would happen is there'd be a, a key lit up on key one on the alpha. When I hit that, it would move the octave down. If I said octave when 10 down, there'd be a key lit up on key 10, which would, when you hit it, would move the octave down. So I don't want, I don't want any of the keys on the alpha to represent this new command I'm writing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to say octave uh, when 200 down. So octave when 200 down, hit enter. Uh, you see it says OK. So because there's only 120 keys on the alpha, th that's never going to show up in one of my key groups. Um, so I've got this, got this new one, octave when 200 down. I could do the same for up. So I'll say octave when 201 up. So now I've got these virtual key 200 and key 201 uh, that move the octave of key group 1 down and up. OK, um, so that's, that's all sorted now with the talker. So I'll say all join to get out of this conversation. Uh, and then the next thing I need to do is connect the pedal um, to the talker. So this is the slightly longer bel canto phrase. So what I need to say is I say uh, keyboard pedal output 3. Remember, switch pedals 1 and 2 are actually represented as pedal 3 and 4 in the system. So I say keyboard pedal output 3, uh, 2, octave talker 1. Okay, so that's, that's the octave talker I was just playing with. Key group, key keyboard pedal output 3 to octave talker 1. Activation, because that's the name of the input I'm connecting to. And then this is the important bit. So I'm saying using 200. And what that does is it connects the pedal as a kind of virtual key, it's, it will become the key 200 for that talker. Um, so that's using 200. So keyboard pedal output 3 to octave talker 1, activation, using 200, and then connect. Fingers crossed, I hit enter, and that's all good. So down in the bottom you can see it says OK. And hopefully now, that's, that's all good. Yeah, so you can see now, um, if you go to the, the um, yeah, so you can see this, that's it, OK. So I'll zoom in here to my um, little thing. So I can press the talker now, and you'll see in the... Um, go on, you press it. <laughs> you can see, well, basically, that there's a load of blue messages coming up showing that when I'm hitting the talker, in, in my little feedback window in the Eigen Commander, it's saying octave when 200 down. So, so now, let's just try that quickly. So don't press that for a sec. OK, so now... So that's working. Um, I'll do another really quick example because last time I just tried to do the metronome as well. So the problem was last time is uh, there's, there's a funny thing going on where unless, the, where unless it's an existing talker that's connected up somehow to the key groups, um, you, I can't, at the moment we can't build an isolated talker just for the pedals, we have to use one that's before. So just in case people want to do it with the metronome, um, the talker that controls, so, so this, um, when I choose my drummer and metronome controls, so I hold down the mode key of key group one, choose this key in the top left of this kind of 4x5 grid. Uh, so if you've got an alpha, you would have seen this. It's similar for the um, similar layout for the tau and a slightly different layout for the pico, but the same kind of thing. Um, so I've got the metronome start-stop button um, here. Um, so this is called Talker 99, this one. Uh, so that's the drummer in the drummer and metronome talker is called Talker 99. So, um, so I'm going to just do a really quick one. I'll just go through it quickly. So Talker 99 listen, um, and then metronome listen. So now I've got the talker and the metronome in my conversation. And then I'm going to say, uh, when 200, uh, toggle start. OK, so that's the command. If I, if I wanted to just start the metronome, I could say metronome hey, uh, toggle start, and that would toggle between start and stop. I could also just say metronome hey, start, and that would start it, or metronome hey, and stop. But toggle start kind of toggles between start and stop. So when 200, uh, toggle start, and press enter. And just check down here, it says OK. And then again, so I'm going to connect the pedal up again. So it, it was keyboard, pedal, output 3, uh, to talker 99 activation using, using 200 connect. So remember, I said when 200 toggle starts. So this is virtual, virtual key 200. And this phrase I'm writing now is basically connecting the pedal up as if it was um, key 200. That's what the using 200 means. OK, so keyboard, pedal, output, keyboard, pedal, output 3 to talker 99 activation using 200 connect, hit enter, 
And they're like, oh, that's because I, I didn't get out of my conversation. So quickly say, all join, leave the conversation that had the talker and the metronome in. Uh, I'll put that in again. If I press, in case you didn't know, if you press up, you can scroll through your old phrases and, and say them again. Um, okay, so that worked this time. Keyboard pedal output three to talk in 99. And then now, if you, I'll put some drum loops on. Okay. Three. I'm going to do it again. Yeah, stop. So there you go. There's the pedal thing. Um, cool. Okay, I'm the evening. <laughs> Uh, so, so that's the pedal thing. Um, hopefully, as well, you saw that I um, uh, I put some I put a script on the forum as well to show you how to connect a build a new drummer and connect that to the headphone. It's afterwards. on the wiki page. It's on the wiki page. Is it? Yeah. Oh, great. Which I'll just put back in there. Can we use oh that? no, not the script today. Oh, sorry. No, from last week. Oh, okay. From last week, yeah. I put it on the forum on the seminars. Great. Right. But we can put that on the wiki as well. 